Novak Djokovic will be able to play in January's Australian Open after the immigration minister overturned a ban on the tennis star's entry because of his unvaccinated status. The Serb was deported from Australia in the lead-up to this year's Grand Slam tournament and was originally barred from the country until 2025. 영어 청취 가랑비 귀뚜라미 영어 오늘의 공부를 시작합니다. Donald Trump has confirmed that he will run for the White House again in 2024. The former president, who was impeached twice, still hasn't admitted he lost to Joe Biden two years ago. Some in the Republican Party had urged him not to run again after he did less well than they'd hoped in the midterms. Donald Trump has confirmed that he will run for the White House again in 2024. The former president, who was impeached twice, still hasn't admitted he lost to Joe Biden two years ago. Some in the Republican Party had urged him not to run again after he did less well than they'd hoped in the midterms. Donald Trump has confirmed that he will run for the White House again in 2024. 두 번이나 탄핵된 트럼프 전 대통령은 2년 전조 바이든에게 졌다는 사실을 아직도 인정하지 않고 있습니다. 공화당 일각에서는 그가 이번 중간 선거에서 기대에 미치지 못한 뒤 대선에 다시 출마하지 말라고 촉구했습니다. Donald Trump has confirmed that he will run for the White House again in 2024. The former president, who was impeached twice, still hasn't admitted he lost to Joe Biden two years ago. Some in the Republican Party had urged him not to run again after he did less well than they'd hoped in the midterms. Donald Trump has confirmed that he will run for the White House again in 2024. The former president, who was impeached twice, still hasn't admitted he lost to Joe Biden two years ago. Some in the Republican Party had urged him not to run again after he did less well than they'd hoped in the midterms. Donald Trump has confirmed that he will run for the White House again in 2024. The former president, who was impeached twice, still hasn't admitted he lost to Joe Biden two years ago. Some in the Republican Party had urged him not to run again after he did less well than they'd hoped in the midterms. Run, 잘 아시는 단어인데요. 동사로 35개 뜻이 있는데 몇 가지만 보시겠습니다. To move using your legs. 다리를 이용해서 이동하는 거죠. Going faster than when you walk. 걷는 것보다 더 빨리 달리다라는 의미가 있겠고요. To operate or function. 기계류가 작동하다라는 의미가 있고. To flow. 예, 강이나 어떤 액체 같은 것이 흐르다라는 의미도 있고요. 본문의 쓰인 뜻은 To be a candidate in an election. 선거의 어떤 후보자가 되는 거죠. For a political position. 정치적인 자리를 놓고. Especially in the US. 미국에서 선거에 출마하다라는 의미가 되겠습니다. She is planning to run in the election. 하게 되면 그 여자는 선거에 출마를 계획하고 있습니다. The tears ran down her cheeks. 하게 되면 눈물이 그녀의 땀을 타고 흘러내렸습니다. Impeach. To charge an important public figure. 아주 중요한 공적인 인물을 기소하는 거죠. With a serious crime. 아주 심각한 범죄에 대해서 탄핵하다라는 의미가 되겠고요. 또 다른 의미는 to raise doubts about something. 뭔가에 대해서 의문을 제기하다라는 뜻도 되겠습니다. The president was impeached by Congress for lying. 대통령은 의회에 의해서 거짓말에 대해 탄핵이 되었습니다. Donald Trump has confirmed. Donald Trump가 확인을 했습니다. That he will run for the White House again in 2024. 다시 대선에 출마할 것이라고 2024년에. The former president who was impeached twice. 두 번이나 탄핵을 당한 트럼프 전 대통령은 Still hasn't admitted. 아직도 인정하지 않고 있습니다. He lost to Joe Biden two years ago. 2년 전에 조 바이든에게 졌다는 사실을. Some in the Republican Party had urged him not to run again. 공화당 일각에서는 그에게 촉구했습니다. 출마하지 말라고. After he did less well than they had hoped. 그들이 기대했던 것보다 더 잘하지 못한 후에. In the midterms. 이번 중간 선거에서 He will run for the White House. 백악관을 위해서 출마하는 것이 아니라 백악관은 대통령직을 상징하니까 대선에 출마한다고 해석을 하셔야 되겠습니다. Some 하게 되면 약간 일부인데요. 예, 본문에서는 약간의 사람들, 일부의 사람들이라는 뜻이 되겠고요. Some in the Republican Party, 공화당에서의 일부 사람들이 
일각에서는이라고 번역을 했습니다. Urged him not to run again. 그에게 다시 출마하지 말라고 촉구한 거죠. 투 부정사의 부정은 낫을 바로 그 앞에 위치시켜서 하게 됩니다. 도널드 트럼프 has confirmed that he will run for the White House again in 2024. The former president, who was impeached twice, still hasn't admitted he lost to Joe Biden two years ago. Some in the Republican Party had urged him not to run again after he did less well than they'd hoped in the midterms. Donald Trump has confirmed. Donald Trump has confirmed. Donald Trump has confirmed. That he will run for the White House again in 2024. That he will run for the White House again in 2024. That he will run for the White House again in 2024. Donald Trump has confirmed that he will run for the White House again in 2024. Donald Trump has confirmed that he will run for the White House again in 2024. Donald Trump has confirmed that he will run for the White House again in 2024. The former president, who was impeached twice. The former president who was impeached twice. The former president who was impeached twice. Still hasn't admitted. Still hasn't admitted. Still hasn't admitted. He lost to Joe Biden two years ago. He lost to Joe Biden two years ago. He lost to Joe Biden two years ago. The former president who was impeached twice still hasn't admitted he lost to Joe Biden two years ago. The former president who was impeached twice still hasn't admitted he lost to Joe Biden two years ago. The former president, who was impeached twice, still hasn't admitted he lost to Joe Biden two years ago. Some in the Republican Party had urged him. Some in the Republican Party had urged him. Some in the Republican Party had urged him not to run again. Not to run again. Not to run again. After he did less well than they'd hoped in the midterms. After he did less well than they'd hoped in the midterms. After after he did less well than they'd hoped in the mid. Some in the Republican Party had urged him not to run again after he did less well than they'd hoped in the midterms. Some in the Republican Party had urged him not to run again after he did less well than they'd hoped in the midterms. Some in the Republican Party had urged him not to run again after he did less well than they'd hoped in the midterms. 오늘의 뉴스는 2024년 대선에 출마할 것이라고 밝힌 도널드 트럼프 전 대통령에 관한 소식이었습니다. 다시 한번 들으시면서 오늘의 공부를 마무리하시기 바랍니다. Donald Trump has confirmed that he will run for the White House again in 2024. The former president who was impeached twice still hasn't admitted he lost to Joe Biden two years ago. Some in the Republican Party had urged him not to run again after he did less well than they'd hoped in the midterms. 오늘보다 더 나은 내일을 위해 노력하시는 자신에게 칭찬을 해주시는 여러분이 되시길 바랍니다. 시청해주셔서 감사합니다.